Hi everyone, I'm Sasha for CG Tuts. In this video I will talk about blueprints. I will show you where you can find blueprints, how to split them apart inside Photoshop and how to use these parts in 3D Studio Max without planes. So let's start and go to theblueprints.com and go to the blueprints database and basically here you can find almost any blueprint that you're looking for uh, you need to be a registered member if you want to download blueprints in original size and I guess that the blue ones are free so when you get uh, when you have a blueprint open it in Photoshop and we can start so double click to unlock uh, personally I don't like white background and you all know that in 3D Studio Max all edges are white so white background of blueprint and white edges can cause uh, problems while you're modeling so let's change a background color go to image adjustments and replace color with eyedropper tool selected click on white space and turn down the lightness something like negative 50 will be okay and now you can see we don't have clean black lines uh, we can fix that with fuzziness default value is 40 so let's boost it up to 200 and hit OK. Now let's make a new file with 1024 and height 1024 and hit OK. Unlock it and call it BG. Go back to blueprint and with rectangular mark, mark key tool select like this part here and now let's zoom and go to select and transform selection and and now here you can adjust selection okay double click copy and paste here now go to edit transform scale and hit on aspect ratio button and let's try with 37 percent double click yeah that will fit okay now go to view and show grid and now let's align tires with center line here so okay let's zoom in and with move tool selected you can move the image with arrows so that will be okay let's zoom out now go back to blueprint and select this part here let's zoom go to select transform selection same thing like with this part okay sorry okay double click copy and paste edit transform scale aspect ratio button selected 37 percent 
double click. Now let's turn down uh, opacity on layer 2. Something like 50%. And let's zoom in. And let's go to move tool and make sure that this edge is aligned with this edge and let's check on front side yep they fit perfectly so let's zoom out now go to image transform rotate and rotate this top image for 90 degrees actually negative 90 and double click and move it to center uh, something like that now go back to blueprint and let's select this guy zoom in select transform selection okay Double click, copy, paste, edit, transform, scale, 37%, double click. Now let's hide side picture and let's turn down opacity on this layer also. Let's zoom in and go to move tool and let's try to match these two sides. Yeah, that fits perfectly. So let's uh, unhide this layer here and let's align tires. okay as you can see the roof is aligned perfectly also uh, you can find uh, blueprints where all sides are not perfectly scaled so if you have blueprint like that you will just go to edit transform scale and you will try to align the roofs undo now let's zoom out and now we can hide grid okay and let's turn back opacity now select this color here hit OK and select paint bucket tool and with background layer selected click on background okay now let's hide all layers except this one and let's go to file save and name it side jpeg and hit save okay now hide this guy and unhide this one and go to file, save, jpeg and top, ok, hide this guy and unhide this one, file, save, jpeg, front.
save. And now we can jump to Max. Uh, make sure that you start the Max as administrator. You will see why in a few moments. Uh, what we need to do now is to import uh, blueprints to our viewports. So hit uh, one viewport and go to views and viewport background and viewport background. Or you can hit on keyboard Alt and B. Uh, here you can see select the viewport and let's go to files and find our blueprints. Uh, side one and hit uh, match bitmap and log zoom and pan and hit OK. Now if you zoom in you can see that we don't have really nice and clean lines. To fix that go to customize preferences and viewports configure driver and we need to change these two values to this one and this one and hit OK. Now if you hit OK uh, you need to restart uh, Max to apply these changes but if you didn't start Max as ad administrator changes won't be applied so hit OK and exit. Now let's open Max again Let's try now, Alt B, files, side, open, match bitmap, log zoom and pan, OK. Now if you zoom in you see we have nice clean lines. Again, Alt B, files, top, open, match bitmap, log zoom and pan. And same thing here, files, front, match bitmap, log zoom and pan. For back view you will just switch here to back view and import back blueprint. To test our blueprints go to select a box primitive and let's make one box okay okay as you can see height is same here and here matching perfectly with also so now you can start to model your car or something else. I hope you guys enjoyed and see you next time.